the knowledge of the holy is understanding acquaint now thyself with him our ideas of education take too narrow and too low a range there is need of a broader scope a higher aim true education means more than the perusal of a certain course of study it means more than a preparation for the life that now is it has to do with a period with a whole being and with a whole period of existence possible to man it is the harmonious development of the physical the mental and the spiritual powers it prepares the student for the joy of service in this world and for the higher joy in the world of service in the world to come education 13 page 13 paragraph 1 the source of such an education is brought to view in these words of the holy writ pointing to the infinite one in him are hid all the treasures of wisdom colossians 2 3 he hath counsel and understanding job 12 13 the world has its great teachers men of giant intellect and extensive research men whose utterances have stimulated thought and opened to view vast fields of knowledge these men have been honored as guides and benefactors of their race but there is one who stands higher than they we can trace the line of the world's teachers as far back as human records extend but the light was before them as the moon and the stars of our solar system shine by the reflected light of the sun so as far as their teachings true do the world's great thinkers reflect the rays of the sun of righteousness every gleam of thought every flash of the intellect is from the light of the world in these days much is said concerning nature and the importance of higher education the true higher education is that imparted by him with whom is wisdom and strength according to job 12 13 out of whose mouth cometh knowledge and understanding proverbs 2 6 in the knowledge in the knowledge of god all true knowledge and real development have their source whenever we turn in the physical the mental or the spiritual realm in whatever we behold apart from the blight of sin is knowledge is revealed whatever line of investigation we pursue with a sincere purpose to arrive to truth we are in touch with the unseen mighty intelligences that is working in and through all the mind of man is brought into communion with the mind of God and the infinite with the finite the effect of such communion on body and mind and soul is beyond estimate <laughs>